Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we're doing a reading for Sign of Scorpio. And keep in mind that this does not resonate for every Scorpio. If you like a personal reading, that is going to be down below in the description where you can find that on my website. You can also find a bunch of other things there on that website too, and it's free to sign up and join. So go ahead and go check it out. Um, also, Spirit of Scorpio Tarot in the shop section of my website is currently half off, and that lasts until November 1st, so go get that while it's there. But let's see what we have going on for our Scorpios today. You're manifesting. We have Odin you're connecting with, but you're manifesting, Scorpio. What are you manifesting here? You're manifesting success, achievement, victory, blockages that were in your way being removed here. We have you also connecting with Sobek. So we have Sobek. We have Odin here. We have the World Tree you're connecting with. The World Tree is allowing you to connect with different spiritual realms, Scorpio. And we have you being in this flow. You're in this flow of life. You're in this flow of abundance here, all right? But it feels like your manifestations just flow to you easily is what it feels like and what's satisfying to you also flows in easily everything just happens easily here we have the raven okay so the raven is here you're going to be receiving some psychic dream messages what it what it feels like to you and you're going to be seeing different spirits in your dreams scorpio so be prepared for that you're also going to have fortune coming your way you're going to have good luck here i swear you're about to get super blessed here scorpio some of you guys could also be getting married, or if you're already married, staying married here. Um, but you guys have new money opportunities coming in for you. Okay, so let's go over here to these cards and let's see more for you. So tell me more for Scorpio. There's something here being offered to you. Yeah, I feel like it's the new money opportunity that's being offered to you, and I feel like you're looking at this, Scorpio. You're going to be getting everything that you've been wishing for is what it feels like for you, the emperor, and you guys are stepping up as the emperor. Usually you're not the emperor in tower, but today I feel like you're embodying the emperor. Some of you guys be getting promoted, or maybe you're the boss here. Maybe your business is growing with the emperor. Okay. So, high priestess. You guys may also be popping up as high priestess. What this is telling me is that you're moving forward with your intuition on the next steps that you're taking, Scorpio, before you take any steps here. And I feel like you're making the most balanced decisions. You're making the decisions here that make sense for you. But I also, you're you're going in a new direction, Scorpio, and I feel like you're using your intuition as you're moving forward into this new direction. But like I said, you're making you're making the correct steps here. Okay. So let's see more on what we have going on for you. These cards, since we have business coming out, we're going to grab these cards. Connect social media. All right. So if you do have your business here, using your social media to your advantage. It says use social media efficiently to connect with your audience. Be specific about what outcomes you desire from your efforts and focus your actions there. Broadcast on the air. Develop your unique voice and get your message out to your ideal client or ideal audience. Consider starting a podcast or radio show. So you guys may be going on like the radio here, maybe broadcast broadcasting on the radio about your business or something like that, or a podcast here. Muse. Take time away from the daily hustle. Give yourself quiet time in nature to muse. Create space for your creativity and fresh ideas will flow. So I feel like some of you guys, um, you may be going out in nature here, maybe going someplace by the beach, kind of rejuvenating, but also getting some fresh ideas while you're out doing that. Scorpio. Funnel. This is leads, prospects, customer sales. Create a dynamic customer experience that nurtures prospects to become paying clients. Build a simple sales funnel. So yeah, this is, I feel like this is funneling in people from social media, maybe the radio as well, or a podcast, um, to become clients, Scorpio, which then makes you sales. All right? So let's go over here and let's see more for you. You're attracting in your heart's desires here. And what you've been praying for is coming in for you. And you're manifesting. Once again, you're manifesting your heart's desires. Uh, we have crows that you're connecting with Scorpio. The Empress. There's somebody here that's approaching you romantically. Like I said, there's somebody there's somebody here wanting to get married to you. Or if you're already married, maybe, maybe you're going on a date with your, your spouse or something. But there's somebody here wanting to take you on a date, Scorpio. They're showing up with flowers. They're showing up in the horse here. They got the picnic here for you. 
is also what it feels like. Um, yeah, there's there's somebody here that has a lot of interest in you. And it also feels like you're getting the knowledge that you need, Scorpio, that's going to allow you to progress forward. But I feel like this person's trying to learn more about you here because they're wanting they're wanting to take you out on a date, Scorpio. They're wanting they're wanting to be with you. Is what I feel like. So they're trying to learn your schedule. Like when is Scorpio free? That's what this person is wondering. You're attracting in your heart's desires, Scorpio. And you're attracting in love. Alright, like I said, there's somebody here for you. Okay? And this feels like the happy love here. The sun, death card. Could be another Scorpio like yourself coming your way. Somebody here with some heavy Scorpio within their birth chart. The moon. Maybe that's their moon sign or something. But we also have you guys connecting with your moon sign. Uh, there could be somebody here moving. Are you moving, Scorpio? Comment down below if you're moving here. But I once again, I feel like you're trying to make the most balanced decisions, Scorpio. Even when you're moving. All right? Some of you guys may be grounding yourself out in nature. It's going to connect with nature so you can get ideas here. Um, either you're watching somebody or there's somebody watching you. But you guys are stepping into your own personal empowerment here. All right. If you, okay, what I think here is that you may be watching three different people have a misunderstanding here. I feel like you're the one on the outside looking in, seeing that there's some people that just don't really understand each other and they're getting to some sort of conflict because there's a misunderstanding here. All right is what I feel like the situation may come may be resolved is what I feel like because we have Archangel Michael stepping in so we have you guys connect with Archangel Michael Archangel Michael is coming in as your guys's protector here you have the princess of wands the princess of wands is the princess that's fiery she's ambitious here she's passionate can either be you or just somebody that's around you but overall what you've been wishing for is coming in for you and it's a very magical time for you Scorpio is what I feel like all right so let's go over here and let's see more what we have going on for Scorpio. Overall, everything you've been wishing for is happening. There's somebody here coming your way romantically. All right. It feels like you guys are focusing here. You're focusing on your work, your career, your education. All right. Once again, you're heading towards a new beginning in your life, Scorpio. And you're moving towards your abundance here with the Empress. We also have you guys connected with your Venus sign. Yeah, once again, there's somebody here coming in with a lot of interest. There's somebody here that's wanting to get married. Some of you guys could also be buying a new home. Once again, comment down below, are you buying the home, Scorpio? Uh, but there's there's work opportunities coming in. There's money flowing in, Scorpio. You may be getting more recognized for your work here is what it feels like. All right, and there's somebody. It feels like you're trying to bring balance. There's somebody here. Yeah, there's somebody here approaching you romantically. Okay. There may be somebody here trying to approach you while you're already in a relationship, and I feel like you may be rejecting that person because it's like you're, you're already with somebody at that point. So it's like, no. You know, Queen of Wands. We have Fire. Fire is Aries here or Sagittarius here. There may be a Fire sign hanging on to you, Scorpio. Fire sign that wants a new beginning with you. Some of you guys also have a new money opportunity coming in once again. But I feel like there's a Fire sign that's wanting commitment with you, Scorpio. I feel like they're wanting to run off and get married with you, <laughs> Scorpio. All right. You know. Some of you guys are not open to this. You're not open to this person. But I feel like you're still extremely happy either way. And once again, we have your money flowing in, Scorpio. It just continues to flow in. We have the Ten of Swords. I don't really like the Ten of Swords. We're going to clarify that in a minute. But there's something here manifesting for you here. Some of you guys could have Gemini in your birth chart. Maybe there's a Gemini wanting to invest into something with you here, Scorpio. Death card, once again, death card is yourself here, but look, there's somebody here that's wanting the happily ever after with you. Could be another Scorpio like yourself, could be Gemini here too. Uh, why is the Ten of Swords here, we're going to clarify. So, what is the Ten of Swords doing in Scorpio's reading? There's a completion, you're just completing out some old cycles, you're letting go of some things in your life, Scorpio, you may be releasing here. And I feel, once again, you're moving towards your own personal happiness. There's somebody coming in. There's somebody here wanting to happily ever after with you. There's somebody here obsessive about you, Scorpio. And once again, there's somebody here wanting to get married to you. Uh, Ten of Pentacles. Once again, Ten of Pentacles is a large sum of money here. It's the family. It's the home. It's the dogs here. It's overall abundance and stability. And once again, you guys have your financial independence. You guys have your financial abundance. 
And it looks like there may be somebody here that you already had conflict with and walked away from before that's already broken your heart before. Um, that you're you're kind of pushing away from your life here, Scorpio. And you, it, it may be somebody here that, you know, was playing you. Could have been another water sign like yourself. But I, either way, I feel like that person, you're releasing them, whoever they were. Okay, so that is what I have for you. If you want to see more content for your sign, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. You can also find even more content on my website too. All right, so goodbye, guys.